think this guy can see us through the tree. Hey everyone, we are Mike and Tess Play, and welcome back to Pokemon Fire Red version. Last time we were on Five Island, and then we found the warehouse, and now we're on Six Island? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Where I just want to check because so far every one of these bookcases has been good. No. <laughs> Except this one. Yeah. Denied. Except this one. Denied. Uh, but there are Pokemon that evolve upon trading, but there are still others. Some evolve when holding specific items. Mm. Yes. This guy's been searching for ruins for 20 years. We're going to find him in like an hour. Maybe even less. <laughs> But yes, Six Island, as you can see by, by looking at the map, the Sevi Islands start to get a little bit more in-depth mm -hmm. when you go on. So Seven Island has paths up and down, Six Island has paths up and down. Our goal is the dotted hole in Ruin Valley. That's where the story takes place. So that's kind of what we're heading towards. And again, we're, we're doing story elements and then exploration after. Yeah. Ooh, Agatha has a record for being the oldest ever Elite Four member. Fame checker. What happens when you finish the fame checker? Nothing. It's just cool. Oh. <laughs> but uh, you wanted us to sell our items. I'm going to hit the wrong button twice in a row. Well, I mean, there's no point in selling now. Why not? I don't know. You still have other items you want to pick up. That's fair. Okay. I'll wait. Yeah. <laughs> And there's like stuff in like the the PC, isn't there? Do yeah. Items over there. There are some items yeah. in the PC still. Yeah. Yeah. I'm looking forward to it. But we don't have to do it now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so nothing interesting in these houses. The first few items, like every house, is like interesting. But eh, at least there's a berry. Okay. I feel like we've used berries once. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> berries only come into play when you're like trying yeah but now we're on the water path there's berries here <laughs> and uh, <laughs> like, here's some berries here's some berries <laughs> and there are no um brand new pokemon in the water path that we haven't encountered somewhere before or that we won't be encountering during our exploration so i'm actually going to spray our last super repel because yeah it's good to it's good to repel things it's the only item in the game you use that is fair <laughs> <laughs> it's the only one that's like this saves time mm. um the mountains around these parts we're, we're next to them there, there's like there's the mountainous ridges like right here he was confused hiker earl he's hungry he hasn't slept in days <laughs> Searching for mountains all around him. He thinks the mountains are giant marshmallows because he's so hungry. <laughs> he just wants to know where his destination is. Yes. He doesn't know he's so close. He does not know. He'll never know. Nope. Yeah. Because our butterfly just destroyed his giant rock snake. Yes. That's still so satisfying. Hmm. Yeah. I agree. Just because it's like, hello, I'm a little butterfly. I'm going to wreck your world. Hmm. And that's amusing, mm. no matter how many times it happens. Can you tell the crab you surf? If I teach it to him. Mm. <laughs> but both has surf, eh. I'm we don't curious. need to. Ruin Valley. Here is a place full of exploration. And I... I mean... Oh my gosh, you need strength. I do. Oh. But, oh, you thought it's a Utella crab. <laughs> yeah. Got it. <laughs> That's how I was able to box Dennis. <laughs> Got it. A sunstone. Sunstone can evolve Gloom into Vile Plume, or Sunkern, who I don't think we've run into yet, into Sunflora. That's all for this game. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh... <laughs> So, you know, if you've been using a Gloom and just don't like Bioplume, you can get a Blossom now. Hmm. Wait, you can only get it now? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I mean, you could have evolved it into Bioplume all along, but... Uh, yeah, but to get its know. final... Yeah. 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 And good, Repel War Off. Because, uh, there are 
I believe, three new Pokemon to be found here in Roan Valley. That is uh, one definitely is one of them. Yeah. Hi, Meowth. Bye, Meowth. But yeah, there are three here. And uh, there's the first one, Yanma! He's a bug flying type. He joins several other Pokemon that we've encountered here so far who are terrible currently, but became really, really good in the next generation. So it's a very low level. But he appears 10% of the he time. He looks like he has a Rotom on his butt. You have learned the secret of Yenma. <laughs> Yenma is now ashamed and angry. <laughs> and hey, here's the next one! Natu! <sighs> it would be so much fun if they were high leveled and we can actually do things with these things. But um, yeah, Natu appears 25% of the time. And he is a psychic flying type, which is... Different. Different, good... What Butterfree wishes he was. He doesn't look like he'd be psychic flying. I know. He looks like an angry bird. He is an angry bird. No, like the angry bird. No, I know. Oh. They're, they're, they're based on Natu. I don't know if it's true, but it looks true, so I'm <laughs> going with it. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> That's two. The third one is the rare one. And the third one is the one you don't want to run into if you are not prepared. You're right. Big chickens. Big chickens. Sorry, little chickens. That's right, he's little chickens. He is little chickens. Yes. <laughs> it's not something you want to run into here. Yes. Uh, that's the goal. <laughs> but this place is a maze. Oh. Well, that's convenient. Hi, Wobbuffet! <laughs> Wobbuffet is a weird Pokemon. Is it because he has an unknown on his foot? Um, that's actually his brain. Oh. Wobbuffet are weird. It looks like an unknown. I agree, it does. <laughs> But Wobbuffet's a pure psychic type, has no form of offense, just counter and mirror coat. But what made him so good that he was actually banned and competitive for this generation is Shadow Tag. Can't run, can't switch, can't do anything but fight him. And since he counters and mirror coats everything, and has a tremendous amount of HP... <sighs> just catch it. Oh, you, oh, I was just going to KO it. Oh, then do that. Because uh, we can put it to sleep, so now it's much less likely to be able to counter us. And then use a super effective stab move. Yes. From a Pokemon more than double its level. <laughs> yes. And Pi gains a level! All, all fun. <laughs> but yeah, those are the new Pokemon who can be encountered in Ruined Valley. Well, that's only 5% of the time, so I'm actually very glad that he showed up so quickly. Now we catch him at 5%. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Stupid Kangaskhan. I know. <laughs> oh my goodness. And you know what? We're we're just starting our explorations of Ruined Valley, but there's a lot to go over here, so we'll continue it next time. So thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time for more post-game for Pokemon Fire Red version.